hey guys welcome back to my channel and to yet another video today i will be checking in for week two of february for the year of 2020 and i'll just go right ahead and get started so the first thing i want to do is to rate all my transactions for this uh, past week so that i can go ahead and um, indicate them in my little calendar and then we can now finish up with this lot here where we check in the actual figures so let me zoom you in a little bit so on the 8th i have one transaction and that is for 100 groceries actually food groceries on the ninth I have a hundred transport that was my fare uh, on the tenth I spent another 100 transport that was for my fear and then on the 12th to the 15th I spent 400 shillings for my transport There's a hundred for groceries. Then on the fourteenth, I took out a hundred shillings, which was meant for groceries, but we ended up eating out. But I use this money for as a top up for something. But I had already taken it out, so I didn't think I needed to bring it back into my envelope. And then on the 15th is the day I had the most transactions this week. And there was a hundred for groceries. Actually, on the 14th. I spent 200 on food, not 100. And the 15th was 100 for food. Then I spent 400. Um, I just write hair because it was hair related and it was from my, my hair category, my beauty envelope. And then I had one unbudgeted expense. And I used this for, to top up for my hair because it was more expensive than I expected. And that was from my miscellaneous account. So with all that written down, let's jump right ahead to our calendar. And just to save on time, I've already put down all the stickers that we need, that I need for this uh, check-in. So I'll go ahead and start with the first one. I will not be flipping back and forth because I have this little book where I've indicated every transaction. So as I've written on the 8th, let me just flip back so that I can show you guys. So on the 8th, I spent 100 on food and the yellow is groceries. So I spent 100 on food. And then on the 9th, yellow, green is for fair, so on the 9th, I spent 100 shillings for fair. On the 10th, I spent 100 shillings again on fair. On the 11th, there were not no transactions so i'll jump over to the 12th 
the 12 there's 400 for transport and that is the green little sticker over here so I'll just indicate 400 then there's another transaction on the 12th and yellow is groceries so on the 12th I spent a hundred on groceries jump uh, and the reason why I'm not writing every single day because I just check it for one day if, if possible if there are no gaps in between so it's 400 because it's one two three four days and I've just put some washi to indicate those uh, four days one sticker and three days for the washi then on the 13th we have a hundred for groceries On Valentine's Day, the 14th, I spent 200 on groceries. So, 200 on groceries. And then the last one is on the 15th, which I had three transactions. The first one is 100 for groceries, and that is the yellow tab. So, the 100. And then 400 for here, which is the blue, and that is my appointment tab. So, I'll just write the amount first. And then on top, I will just write here. And then the last transaction was for 100 shillings from my unbudgeted envelope. And I'll just indicate that I use that for my hair as well. So those were all the transactions I did for this week. So let's just go ahead and do the final part, which is to actually check in for each and every one of those little slots over there so we will start with our fare and so let's just do the total of the fare so on the ninth the ninth the fare is a hundred that's another hundred that's four hundred so the total fare is six hundred so for this week we have spent 600 on fare and on our previous check-in our balance was 1800 so we'll go ahead and take 1800 minus the 600 you have just spent we're supposed to have a balance of 1200 so 1200 let's just go ahead to that envelope and that flash card and check in for that I've already brought them out and I'm really loving these envelopes because I don't even have to take them out really except for the long term ones but because of this check in I have them here so for my fare I'm supposed to have 1000 actually I'm supposed to have 1200 and I've indicated 1300 I think the mistake came in where I had to oh yes this amount is supposed to be in my groceries if I'm not wrong yes because there's a day I actually you know what I think I'll just go, I'm just going to leave it there I think I'm just going to leave it there leave it aside and confirm what the problem might be so let's just leave it pending and then let's jump into our groceries Groceries are the yellow tabs. <laughs> Our groceries are the yellow ones. So we have 100. That's another 100. Plus another 100. Plus another 200. Plus 100. So we have spent 600 again for our groceries. And the last time we checked in was uh, 1,800. So 1,800 minus what we have spent 600. I'm supposed to have 1,200 in that envelope. And that is what is indicated in the flashcard. Let us just confirm with the... And that is how it is. We have 1,200. Okay. 
because it's correct i'll just go ahead and put this back and then i'll i'll go back to my fair and confirm why that is the way it is so next we are going to be checking in for our un our unbudgeted expense which is a hundred shillings that is the dark pink uh, sticker so a hundred shillings we have spent a hundred shillings in that from that envelope so just go ahead and indicate a hundred and the last time we checked in we had a balance of 150 so it means we have we should have a balance of 50 shillings in that envelope that is what is indicated in my little flashcard and indeed that is what is in the envelope next i'll just go ahead and uh, bring out the other envelope that I touched which is my hair or my beauty envelope and I will not be checking it in here because I do not consider it as a category to be checking it in in for every single week so um, the last time I had I checked in was on the third and I had 400 shillings on the 15th as indicated in my calendar I have spent um, 400 shillings so I'm supposed to have zero in that envelope and there's nothing in that envelope and I'll just close that one and then I'll just go back to my fair and confirm where the problem came in I have realized where the mistake came in is I put a green tab on the ninth of which I don't have any the last one was on the eighth then it was supposed to start from the tenth because on the ninth was a Sunday I did not I did not do any transaction any fair I did not use any fair on this particular day so I'll just take this off so that my face supposed to change because I did not I did not use any fair on the 9th so I'm supposed to have a hundred plus four hundred um, and that's supposed to be five hundred I used up five hundred shillings for my fair for this whole week so it's not supposed to be six hundred but five hundred the previous week I had a balance of one thousand eight hundred minus the 500 so i'm supposed to have 1300 as indicated in that envelope in that flash card so i'll just take it's correct i'll just take the 100 shillings back to that little envelope over here and just close this one and that is all we'll be checking in for this week i really hope you enjoyed watching this video and i want to give a shout out another shout out to all my new subscribers thank you so much for considering my channel and for sticking around um if you are new please consider subscribing and liking my videos it's a really it's really encouraging so i hope to see you in my next video which will be uploaded shortly Thank you for your time, for your support. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.